There must be some other way to get copies of those documents. There isn't. There's not a central database? Uh, there is, but with the budget cuts, we've only scanned in through the M's. So you're telling us that all the files on Bennett Thompson's are gone forever? It looks that way. Okay, then we're going to have to find the man you gave it to. Um, any idea how to locate him? All I know is his name. Rex That's Bowles. not his name. If you say so. Just one more question. Could you tell us what the man looked like? How many one more questions are there going to be? Please. This man is a murderer. And anything you can tell us could help save someone's life. If he's really not you? He's not. We swear. Could you please just tell us uh, what he looked like? I didn't pay that much attention. But he was tall, had dark hair, clean cut, you know, a professional type. Mr. Manning, do you have anything to add before I sentence Mr. Thornhart? Uh, yes, I do. Um, the truth is, I never really liked the kid, <laughs> not from the beginning. Um, when he was going after my daughter, I, I thought I knew exactly what he wanted. I thought he was just going to take whatever he wanted and, and then throw it away. <laughs> of course, I'm not going to let anyone throw my daughter away. And to be honest with you, I think she's probably better off without him. But that being said, It's me, Hannah O'Connor. Uh, please, I need to talk to you. We have nothing to talk about. Yes, we do. You know exactly what we have to talk about. But that being said, the kid has some pretty good reasons to hate me. I'm not saying that I wasn't right most of the time. Why wouldn't you believe that I pushed his mom down the stairs? Um, I don't think that gave him the right to assault me. But I know that if anybody hurt someone I love, that I would probably do the same thing. Or actually, I would do the same thing. And uh, it would be me sitting there about to be sentenced. And I deserve it. Uh, but I love my daughter and my granddaughter, most of all. I don't want anything or anyone to hurt them. And I would hate to see my granddaughter grow up without a father. That didn't seem fair to me. So, if you really want my opinion about this whole thing, then I actually think you should let him go home. <laughs> <laughs> 